What's going on, traders? I hope your day is going well. We are entering a new month, the month of August. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and first start. So Monday, we want to look at the market. So let me go ahead and pull up the market. Let me share my screen with you. Uh, right here we go. This is the Dow here. And so we can see we are, you know, still sideways, but we are moving, grinding slowly but surely a little bit higher, higher lows each week, which is always a good sign. Uh, we're not breaching the MAs. That's always a good sign. You know, so it's just a matter of how soon, I guess, the economy can get back to normal. Um, <clears throat> I won't debate or guess on that. I'm just, you know, going to read the chart, look at the chart, and that's it. That's, that's all, you know, that's all you can do. You really, you know, you can predict all you want, but nine times out of ten, you can be wrong. So that's all good. All right, so here we go. My month of July another profitable month so <clears throat> we're stacking these months we're making money every month that's always good um, very happy about that I have to get I haven't done running the whole numbers for the month of July but I'll run those numbers so we can look at uh, pretty much you know uh, what it looked like for me um, and then uh, now we're going to talk about what I traded today so the first stock I only took one trade I missed one and, and took one so the first stock we're going to talk about uh, is Oh, time, T-Y-M-E. I'm going to share my screen. Okay, so here is time, and this was my game plan. It says, stock is moving on news of an orphan drug placement for pancreatic cancer. We'll buy this off of the MA 129. So what did I see pre-market? Okay, um, I saw two locations that this stock can play off of. Um, the first, of course, is right here off the MA. Okay, it opened up here. I was willing to test this off of the, uh, the 20 MA which I did, I, I got in at 129, I wish I would have got in at 128, but I got in at 129, still moved 3% for me, got out at 133, um, so I was happy with that. Um, and then I actually had a second opportunity that I just didn't play because it was moving, so let's look at the volume. See the volume that was just fading? So I was thinking about playing this at 123, which would have been off of the pre-market uh, play, you know, off of the pre-market candle, but I just thought the, the volume faded, man, and so I didn't touch it. And then, of course, what did it do? It bounces from 123 to 134, which is a great trade opportunity. But such is life, you know, so I'll take what I got. I'm not, not complaining at all. The next stock I'm going to talk about is MARA, the stock that I marred, the stock that I missed off the 10MA. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen. Okay, so Mara. Whoa, uh, I wrote the news on here. Uh, game plan. Did not trade this stock. But it did move off the 10MA, and I opted to not trade it. Okay, the news was that it, it bought it bought some new high tech mining cryptocurrency machines. So I just I, it was it was uh, let me go to the 15 uh, so we can see this. So when I was looking to play it, I was looking to play it right here at 285 off of the 15 minute time frame. Um, I just felt uncomfortable, so I had my order in for the 20MA, and it just did it, it as you can see it was strong as strong can be. So it bounced off of this and it made its run um, and, and that's all good. So here's what it looked like on the three minute time frame. Had I been able to get it, it would have been right here at the 285 mark. And we can see that it immediately, immediately made its move up, consolidated, bounced again, consolidated. It's, it's just right. It's like a, a nice little, um, uh, not necessarily a true blue breakout, but man, it's, you know, it's, 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 uh, these are nice bull flag pullbacks, uh, so, you know, that was that one. I didn't get it. It's all good. So I just was plus one trade today. Uh, either way, I'm happy with it. Um, you can never be upset about taking a profit. Just always stick to the script and do the same old things, uh, at least if they're successful. <laughs> right. So anyhow, that was my trading recap for today. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Uh, let's keep building on a, a great week. All right. I'll see you later.